Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So, today I'm going to be doing something a little bit different. I do tend to film a lot of try-on hauls on my channel and I do love doing those, but I feel like I get a lot of kind of clothes rather than footwear. And I've I got to be honest, I don't buy a lot of shoes, but I find shoes that I love that I think work with those outfits and I just wear them to death. So today I'm going to be talking you through my favourite kind of types of shoes and the ones that I literally wear all the friggin' time. Right, first off, I'm going to start with gym slash workout trainers. <laughs> Because these are the kind of shoes that I wear most often, to be perfectly honest. And I have three favourite pairs of trainers that go with everything. I absolutely love them. I'm not entirely sure how much I paid for all of these shoes, but I will be leaving the link down in the description box anyway. And if I can't find the exact shoe, I'll find something really, really, really similar. But... I'm not one to kind of splash a lot of cash on this kind of stuff anyway. So all of these should be pretty affordable. So first up, I have these. I believe they're called the Adidas Swift Run. Yeah. And they're looking a little bit sad. I have washed them recently, but these are so comfortable. They're a kind of slip-on sock type trainer and these literally just go with everything. You're gonna see from the color palette of the rest of my trainers that I'm pretty boring, but these are really comfortable. You could do cardio with them, in them, do li um, weight lifting in them. They're literally just a perfect all-rounder gym shoe and you can also just wear them out and about. They just look good with everything. Next up is, Steve actually got these for my birthday. I did heavily hint that I wanted them, but these are the New Balance Rove. Yeah, and these are so comfortable. They, they're called Fresh Foam Rove. And again, they're a kind of sock type trainer. You just slip them on and tie them up. You can see this bit here, it's like elasticated. So comfortable. I've not had these that long, but I've worn them to death already. They're already starting to get a bit grubby. They come in a few different colors. I really love these because black and white goes with everything. Yes, I'm boring but you also have these little tiny pops of kind of like neon pink, which I thought was so cool. Yeah, just really comfortable. I've got both of these in size sevens, by the way, UK seven. I do generally tend to wear a seven, so I think all of these are sevens. And next up, continuing the kind of boring theme, I have these all black, what are they, Under Armour? Under Armour trainers, and I actually got these in America. I did find them online for a different haul, I think, that I did. Yeah, these are a UK 7 as well. Again, super comfortable. These are really lightweight as well. I think they're specifically more of a gym shoe rather than a shoe that you go out running in, but I think they're good for either. I wear these out for dog walking a lot as well. They're so comfortable, and because they're dark, they're not gonna get really, really dirty, or well, they're not gonna shut the dirt as much if you were wearing a kind of lighter, white shoe just trying to show you the detailing on them because they're all black i feel like you can't see it as well but there is some really nice detailing to the shoes just really nice and comfortable i mean i did pick these up in an outlet store in america but they were really cheap and i'm pretty sure i found them online they're still a really really affordable type of trainer right next up more trainers let's just get all the trainers out of the way so obviously I've just shown you guys my kind of favorite gym workout trainers and I do actually spend most of my time wearing trainers because guess what? They are comfortable. So I've got a few pairs of more kind of fashionable trainers that would go more with little dresses and things like that. So first up, and excuse me, these are really dirty, but they are my Vans. And I mean, Vans aren't that cheap. I think they're about 40, 50 quid but these bad boys have been with me for a while now and they've been in the washing machine, they're still going strong, I need to give them another wash, but I mean, most of the dirt's just on the kind of rubber sole anyway, so you can just sort of sponge them off. So these are the kind of classic style ones, which are my favorite. So it's kind of slightly suede at the front and at the back and you have that kind of original style skater shoe look. These look great with pretty much everything, to be honest. Most of the time, I just whack them on with a pair of jeans, kind of comfortable t-shirt, 
but they also look really cute with like a little tea dress, anything basically, and perfect kind of airport attire as well. So although they're slightly expensive for a plimp sole style trainer, I always get vans. I've been getting vans for years and years and years now because they stand the test of time. And I think we all know that there is a massive craze right now for kind of chunky trainers. So I did splash out on these ones. I Calvin Klein do a really, really cute pair that I wanted, but I just couldn't, couldn't force myself to kind of pay that money for a pair of trainers. So I got these Nike ones. I can't remember the exact name of these, but yeah, link will be down below anyway. But I love this style because you have the mix of that kind of white and the champagne-y kind of beige colour as well. And there's just so much cool detailing on these shoes. Again, sorry, these are dirty guys, but I've been wearing the hell out of them. These are really, really comfortable. A really nice, chunky, padded out shoe. I'm not going to lie, my feet do feel massive in these because they are so chunky. And like the heel does stick out quite a bit. But... I actually, these are the ones I do normally wear to the airport because I think they look really, really cool with like a nice kind of loungewear set. And yeah, just really comfortable. I'm glad these kind of came into fashion because I'm all about that kind of comfy fashion. I can't remember exactly how much I paid for these. I think it was about 60, 70 pounds. So that's not the cheapest, but Yet again, there are a lot more expensive things out there. There are definitely loads of dupes of things like this that you get, can get for a lot cheaper. But I just think when you get a Nike pair of shoes, you know that they're gonna last you a long time as well. Okay, I'm gonna move on to sandals. So, I've said this before on my channel, if you're new here, I don't really wear sandals. I don't like sandals, I don't find them really comfortable, I just, I never get drawn to a pair of strappy flat sandals, so my kind of go-tos are more of a chunky sandal or a slider, so these ones are actually brand new, I just got these from Office, but in love with these, so I recently got a pair from Pretty Little Thing in black, which I wear all the time, and if you've seen some of my other videos, you'll see me wearing them quite a bit. They're this kind of Birkenstock dupe style sandal. So my black one's a pretty little thing, and I think they're about 18 pounds. So really, really cheap. These are from Office. They're brand new. I only just got them the other day, so I've not worn and tried these, but I am a sucker for gray. Gray is one of my favorite colors. So that kind of gray with the gold detailing on it, I just absolutely love. And I love this Birkenstock style because I'm not sure if you can see it on camera, but it's shaped, it has proper like arch support. I sound like such an old lady. It has proper arch support. And when you're doing loads of walking, pavement walkings, maybe you're on a city break, you're on holiday, you wanna do loads of walking, these aren't gonna absolutely kill your feet, which is so important. So I just checked, these are still on Office. These are 20 pounds. So I think they're in the sale at the moment. Office has a massive sale on, so I suggest you go check it out. So 20 pounds for these is amazing value for Office. Bearing in mind that my black Pretty Little Thing ones, which I'll link below anyway, are, I think they were 18 pounds from Pretty Little Thing, which the quality is not as good as these. So yeah, they do these in different colors as well. I just saw the gray and thought, it's a bit me. And then, of course, my trusty sliders. I love sliders. And I'm kind of new to the slider game. I've only been wearing them the last kind of year, but these are so comfortable. So, I mean, these ones I got from an outlet store again in America. I also have a pair of white Tommy Hilfiger ones. They're white and gray. So those are my two kind of go-tos because they go with so much stuff. These black ones are just nice, simple, love a little slogan kind of style. So they just go with those of stuff. These weren't too expensive. I'll try and find the same, if not similar, online. I'm sure they must do them somewhere. Okay, so sorry to bring up the W word, but winter is gonna be here soon. And I know it's still August, but the weather has changed drastically this last week. So I've kind of been thinking about my winter footwear a little bit more, autumn winter footwear, and 
my go-to when I'm not in trainers is a kind of chunky heel boot. And my other ones are looking a little bit sad, so I picked up these ones. And I am in love with these. So these are from Office again, and I'm pretty sure these were in the sale as well, actually. They're a kind of biker-esque Chelsea boot. And do you know what? I actually saw some of something very, very, very similar to this in Doc Martens last year. Tempted to get them, they were very expensive, I couldn't do it to myself, so I left them. And it just goes to show when you need something, it will just pop up. Because, I mean, I love this really, really practical bottom. I've had so many winter boots that have been a smooth bottom, and as soon as it's wet, raining, whatever, you're gonna slide around. So, sorry to be the boring practical person, but these are gonna be such a lifesaver, especially when it's snowing. And just loving this kind of silver detailing as well. They just feel really good quality, they're really comfy. Obviously I've not tried and tested these properly, but loving these. So like I said, these are from Office and these are in a sale for 25 pounds. Yeah, so that's crazy cheap for a pair of boots from Office. And also what I love about these is, I mean, most of the time I probably just wear them with a pair of like ripped jeans or something like that. I think that looks really cool and edgy. But you can also wear them with, because they're a shorter style boot, wear them with dresses. They're gonna look really cute with a little tea dress, wear them with tights and a dress, skirt, whatever. And yeah, just a really nice all rounder boot. Oh my God, I got pins and needles in my legs. Okay, <laughs> we're nearly there. Right, so last kind of style of shoe that I wear, I'm very much, an either or person, I'm either in trainers or I'm in heels. I feel like there's not much in between. So, love a heeled shoe. I'm gonna show you these ones. So I get, I wear these quite a lot in my try on hauls. I get loads of questions about them. And unfortunately, they're quite old. They're from New Look. And they're a little bit small, they're a size six. Which is why I don't really wear them out too much, but I absolutely love these. So it's a kind of shoe boot style, nice chunky heel, that's a must have for me. And then it has this kind of crossover design. So these are quite old, so I couldn't find an ex the exact link for these, but I have previously found some extremely similar ones from Topshop. So I will link those below. And again, they're really affordable as well. So, yeah, staple kind of black leather shoe boot, goes with so much stuff and great to wear in the evening as well. And they're not gonna absolutely murder your feet like a stiletto would. I also picked up these bad boys from Office. So again, I love this kind of chunky heel style. I find it so much more comfortable to walk around in. And although I love heels, I don't like anything too high or that's too difficult to walk in. So this is probably the maximum height I would wear. I'm five foot seven anyway, so I don't need to be that much taller. Um, anything higher than that, I feel a bit like a gigantor. So these are a size seven again, these fit really nicely. And what I love is that this kind of crossover detail at the front, it's padded, so it's really nice and comfortable. They're not gonna dig in. Really nice kind of nude, suede fabric. So these are gonna go with so much stuff as well. And I instantly just thought with these that these would be great to wear to weddings. I know wedding season's kind of like coming to an end, but just a really good practical shoe. Also, I love that the buckle on it is rose gold as well. It's so cute. These were also in the office sale. So again, not tried and tested these ones because I've only just got them, but they're in the sale 15 pounds. So that is dirt cheap for a pair of office heels like this because I just think office shoes are amazing quality. And last but not least, I say I don't wear sandals. This is the closest to a sandal you will get me in. So again, a little bit of height, but it's all about that comfort. So I got these from Shein. Again, they're a size seven and it's that kind of espadrille flat form style shoe with this nice crossover detail and very similar to the last ones I just showed you. They're that kind of suede effect nude kind of style 
which goes with so much stuff. Since I got these, I've been wearing these to death. They go so nicely with really cute little summery dresses. You kind of feel like you're wearing a pair of heels, but I mean, realistically, the heel height of that is what, like a couple of inches? It's not that high. So really, really, really nice and comfortable. And also the sole on them is kind of like padded and rubbery. So yeah, if you want to wear a pair of slightly heeled sandals that aren't gonna murder your feet, I would totally recommend these. And also a brand like Shein, it's not gonna break the bank. They're pretty cheap. And I've been so surprised with how good the quality of these are as well. Right, so that is everything. I feel like I tried to fire through that really, really quickly. These are just my kind of favorite go-to shoes. Obviously I have more, but these are the ones that I kind of wear or will be wearing a lot. So yeah, like I said, I will be linking everything down below in case you guys do want to check them out. I will say though that I was really surprised with the office sale. I had to rein myself in quite a lot but there are some serious discounts on there at the moment so I would definitely go check them out. If you have enjoyed this video please don't forget to give it a thumbs up because it really supports my channel and if you haven't already subscribed don't forget to hit the subscribe button and I will see you guys next time. Bye!